Hi, Keep Peeps. I'm back. I hope you're all getting super excited for Icon and PartnerCon next week. If you still want to sign up, check out the links in the description below. You won't want to miss it. There's awesome announcements, really exciting product demos. Be sure to make it. In Keep last month, we released a brand new way for you to automate your business, easy automations. And users can now easily re-engage customers just by clicking on the email marketability status in the contact record to send a confirmation email. Wow, I just used the word easy like 10 times. I hope you're all starting to see a trend here. Now for this month's new release report. We've got some really exciting things to show you in Infusionsoft, such as new campaign sequences, and Keep has a brand new Zapier integration and company records. Don't forget to use the timestamps listed below to jump ahead in the video. Now, here's Juicy with new features and updates for Infusionsoft. Thanks, Stephanie. We're gonna take a minute to look through some of these new features. I think you're gonna enjoy them. Automatically cancel a subscription in the campaign builder. We know that a lot of you run businesses off of subscriptions, or at least part of your business, off of a subscription. And we all know how frustrating it can be as someone who has a subscription to get charged for it after the fact if we weren't supposed to have it anymore. That can be super frustrating. So now in Infusionsoft, you can cancel the subscription in the campaign builder. Until now, you had to manually cancel your subscription, which was a lot of manual work, and this should speed things up. In a sequence, you can find cancel subscription with your other tools here. And all you have to do is get in here and choose which subscription you want to cancel. That's it. Super easy. When you do that, the subscription that you chose will be canceled for that contact and will be set to inactive with the end date of today. Now you can be confident that your client subscriptions end when they're supposed to end. And this saves you a lot of time from having to do it by hand when somebody contacts you. Now you can automate that entire process. Add terms to order forms. This is a simple but important change. You can now add terms and conditions to your order forms so that your clients know exactly what they're agreeing to when they sign up for your service or product. When you go to add terms, you can type in custom terms, whatever you like here. And you can also check this box to require them to agree to the terms. So they also have to check a box to say, yes, I've read this and understand. And when a client goes to your order forms, they'll see the terms right here, ready to go. So now you can make sure that your clients are fully informed when they make a purchase and you look professional while doing it. Manage your B2B business with Keeps Companies feature. For any of you that work with other companies, you know how handy it can be to keep track of those companies, not just the contacts from those companies. And now with Keeps Companies feature, you can do just that. In addition to keeping track of all your contacts, now you can go to companies. Using this companies list, you can search for companies that you've done business with or that are in your database. And when you click on that company, you get a list of all of the contacts that are a part of that company. You can add more contacts right here, add details specific to this company. And you can select everybody from this company or you know, take off a couple if you need to. And you have some bulk actions that appear down here at the bottom, add them to a campaign, send a broadcast, or add and remove tags so you can set up automations for anything you might need to do. That should help you keep all of your contacts organized by company, make it much easier to find them and to work with them. This should help all of you B2B customers out there save a lot of time. Company records with their own custom fields. We know how much you all love custom fields and the good news is not only do we have company records, but they have their own separate set of custom fields that you can use to keep track of whatever information you and your industry might need to keep track of for the people that you do business with. So as you just saw, as we were demoing company Companies, not only can you assign and organize contacts based on companies, but you can keep track of general company info as well as their own type of record, just like a contact record. Let's take a look. When you select a company, not only do you get the company list of every contact that's in that company, but you can edit the details of this company and add information that you need to keep track of, whether it's a phone number, fax, website, email, their address, of course, you can delete the company down here. And this is awesome. You can add custom company fields. These work just like custom fields and contacts, but it's their own separate limit tied just to companies.
And as a bonus little tip, if you are looking at any given contact, you can hit this little eye next to their avatar and there's a link to the company right there. Keep Zapier integration. We know how important it is for you to have all of your tools and information in one place. We love Zapier and we are excited to announce that we are making it easier than ever to use Keep and Zapier together. In settings, go check out the integrations page and you'll find a lot more options that are powered by Zapier. For example, if we check out Facebook lead ads, we can do things like when a new lead comes from Facebook, uh, create a task. And down at the bottom, you'll find tons of information about all of the triggers and actions that you can take for each of these integrations. This native integration will let you connect all the standard apps within Zapier for free. There is so much cool stuff that you can do with Zapier and having this native integration will save you time and really increase the power of your app. You can trigger automation, automate your day-to-day -day workflow, and sync tons of information with Keep. And this can save you a lot of time and money. We have a Facebook Live coming up on the 18th to learn all the details about the nitty gritty of this integration, as well as a blog post linked in the description below. Automation's name update. We have brought all of your automations under one roof, whether they're easy automations or campaigns from the campaign builder. Let's take a look. Now you just go to automations and here you'll find all of your easy automations as well as advanced automations. What's that? That's the new name of your campaigns from campaign builder. Now you can find them all in one place, search through just like you're used to, have all the same functionality, but easier and quicker to find. You'll be able to add contacts, view reports, edit your advanced automations. Remember, now called advanced automations, we're called campaigns, right here. And if you click into it, it'll take you right to your campaign. And you still have all the great functionality that you had in Campaign Builder, still here, just easier to find. And now, all of your templates are in one place, whether they're easy automations, like this free consultation template, or they'll be labeled advanced if they use the campaign builder. If you have any questions about these changes, check out the FAQ document linked in the comment below as always, and we hope that this makes things easier for you to find all of your automations in one place. Appointments goal. Now you can trigger automation whenever appointments are set. This is a game changer, let's check it out. Now in advanced automations, remember, that's the new name for the campaign builder, you can trigger automation based off of appointments. There it is with the rest of your goals. When you configure it, you can choose if someone schedules, reschedules, or cancels, and exactly what type of appointment this applies to. The possibilities are endless. If somebody cancels an appointment, you could send them an email asking them to make another appointment with you. And one of my favorites, when somebody is in a nurture sequence and they bite and make an appointment with you, this will let you stop sending them emails, take them out of that nurture sequence so you're not bugging them with something that's no longer relevant to them. We are really excited to see all the creative uses that you all come up with this appointments goal. It's super powerful and it will save you lots of time. View and remove contacts in easy automations. Easy automations make automations, well, easy. And now you have the ability to see who is in an easy automation and to remove them if they shouldn't be there anymore. Keep Mobile 2.0 has launched. We are super excited to announce that Keep Mobile 2.0 has launched with all sorts of new features for you, so let's dig in and check it out. Invoices on Keep Mobile. Now when you go to a contact, you can send them an invoice right from your phone, no matter where you are. It'll bring in all of your line items from your app, so you don't have to create anything from scratch. You can choose the payment methods you accept, add a note, and once you're done, you can preview it to see what they'll see and send it either through a text message, email, or just copy the link and send it some other way. This is super helpful and time-saving for anyone who does business on the go. Communications Command Center. In Keep Mobile 2.0, you can go to the new comms section. Here under communications, you'll see all of the communications that you've had, whether it's calls, voice messages, text messages, it's all here in one place without having to go back and forth. You can filter by unread to quickly catch up on anything you've missed, search, as well as set your do not disturb and your messaging and phone settings. Which brings us perfectly to swipe actions. 
While we're in here looking at our communications, we can swipe to the left and mark these as unread. I love that. I wish my normal text messaging did that. We can also call them or delete the messages right from here. Last but not least, we've got a couple of little things that for some of you will be a big deal. Now, when you're adding contact info, you have the option to add anniversary. So you don't have to use a custom field for that anymore if you're keeping track of anniversary. As well as we now have a dedicated fax field. Again, saving you some custom field entries. And lastly, we've removed auto capitalization when adding new contacts or companies. We all know that companies can have names with different capitals all over the place. And now you won't be forced to always have that first letter be a capital. Thanks, Ducey. Now for this month's fast fact. As many of our users are gearing up their business for Black Friday, I thought I'd share a little fast fact about the holiday. Did you know that Black Friday is the busiest day of year for plumbers? I mean, just think about it. Americans just feasted, plumbers are busy. Yeah, you get the idea. Here's a quick recap of the new features and updates we showed you today. Tons of great updates to help you grow your business with automation, B2B functionality, and integrations. We hope you'll stay tuned next month when we tell you all about Infusionsoft Analytics and we have exciting updates to Forms and Keep. Don't forget, PartnerCon and Icon are happening this week. Check out the link in the description below.